This is Nate Adams with Energy Smart Home Performance and uh, standing in the basement of a deep energy retrofit that I worked on uh, and we're looking at radiant floor which actually I didn't have very much to do with uh, but um, I've just been working my way through understanding how it works and how well it works uh, and so you can tell uh, particularly like if I come right here here's uh, uh, the, the main loop and the set point is currently at 65 I just bumped it from 63 um, and you can see right where the first couple of loops are and they end up dumping quite a bit of heat right in that area um, and then they cool off as they go but you can kind of look for the temperature and see where the loop is going and as it gets cooler particularly when it comes back on this side which is a good place for it to get cooler because uh, right over here that's the south wall um, uh, so it, the south wall is going to get a lot of sun, so it'll get warmed up anyway. So that's not a bad way to go. Uh, but it's just kind of curious to actually get to see how this works. Now it was set at 70 degrees down here, and that made the first floor quite cozy. Uh, but this uses an electric water heater, so it's fairly expensive heat. And so I wanted to turn it down, so I tried it at 63, and that was too cold. So I uh, bumped it to 65 and look for occupant feedback on that.